Hello everyone, this is Bobby Golf over here at Webb. Just got done playing with the guys. Yes, indeed. Uh, talk about the hands today. Let's talk about the hands. Had some calls lately. I know it's a struggle. When you're hitting snap hooks or even topping the ball, if you're doing all the other protocols correctly, five o'clock nose, shoulders, swing plane, all that, what about the hands? If your hands are too low, I know it's a very comfortable feel. And once again, this is what works for me. It's a comfortable feel, but look at look at that radius. I mean. I mean, you're coming. I don't. I don't like it. What I find out when I get in trouble doing something like that, I get lazy. I get tired. My hands drop. Pick them up. Now I'm on that one plain swing that I want. Always want it. Okay. So think about it next time if you're topping the ball. If everything else is working fine, think about your hand position. Okay. This is a par four, got wind in my face. Not sure how strong it is, but I can see the trees. I think it's uh, 390. The last thing I do before I pull the trigger is I lift my hands. That's my trigger. Talking about the hands, the hands, the hands. The last piece of property that we own goes on the on that club. The hands. If they're too low, as far as I'm concerned, you're in trouble. I know, I know, I know. The one percenters, they got their hands down low. Yep. They've been living with a golf club all their lives too. They got the skills, they got the patience, they've got the timing, they've got all the money to make that work for them. What we're trying to do is build a simple system that works for us, okay? Got it, the wind, got it. It's blowing probably about 10 right now. This morning when I was playing with the guys, calm, cool, about 40 degrees right now. I think it's it's running in close to the 70s right now. See if, it, see if you guys can see that. That's a long ways. Yep, okay. All right, since we're, since we, well, yeah, I was looking at the wind. I'm going to take a little extra club. Might be too much, but uh, this is my practice time. I've already, already had my game in the money again. Woohoo, it's sweet. All right. I'm going to take a little three hybrid here because of the wind. It could be too much club. But might have to be. Well, it was going right at it. That I can tell you. Now, where is that right now? I don't know. Nothing like playing by yourself. And you guys that do that, you know what I mean. <laughs> well, let's go take a look. That was 176 with a three hybrid. Too much club if, it, if the wind didn't help me out. Mike's still blowing though. And yep, we're okay. We're on the green. Actually, <laughs> man, I could have used my, my, my Diablo. 
Diablo, huh? Nah. <laughs> Let's don't get stupid here, right? Well, you never know, though. That's uh, probably, I don't know, 30 foot putt, maybe more. But like I said, this is my practice time. This is where I want to work on things that could have brought me some more money earlier. It's all good in the hood right now. Okay, I think this is going to break right to left. Long ways, though. And these greens are not like Santa Maria. These are slow greens. The wind's been blowing, so it could have dried them out some. Santa Maria put, put there, that was terrible. For over here, that is. These are slow greens. I tell you, I've been, I fought them all day long today. Went, went and played uh, Santa Maria Tuesday. And uh, like I said, those are slick greens. And I have not, I did not change my pattern. All right, here we go. Okay, it's, a, it's not even a bogey. I'm practicing. Get your practice and use your time when you can. If you play in a men's group or something like that after after the game, use use the golf course. It's yours. Okay, buy your golf. If I can get you one more, I uh, surely.